This Zen Key Quick Start covers performing an authorization request on your primary mobile device. That is to say, the same device which you have installed your Zen Key app. In this Quick Start, we'll see how you can use the Zen Key iOS SDK to issue a request for a user to authenticate with Zen Key. Then, We'll walk through how to safely and securely retrieve that user's Zen Key tokens and user info from the Zen Key services to enable great experiences within your application. While this quick start uses the Zen Key iOS SDK, the topics we discuss here are applicable to any application running on the same device as your user's Zen Key Carrier mobile app. We'll cover devices without the mobile app in a different video. Before you get started, it's important to ensure you've obtained your client ID, client secret, and that you've configured your redirect URI. You can accomplish these tasks in the service provider portal or by working with your support representative. With that information in hand, let's review the process for supporting an authentication flow using Zenkey at a high level before we do a deep dive. Zenkey uses a version of the OpenID Connect standard, a simple identity layer built on top of the OAuth2 protocol. Additionally, Zenkey implements an extension of this standard called OpenID Discovery to allow us to bring together major mobile network providers behind one unified identity platform. You can read more about OpenID at openid.net. Let's talk through the flow that allows you, as a developer, to leverage the identity information of all of these major network providers through one simple unified user flow. First, we'll connect to the Zen Key services to perform a process called discovery. Through this process, we obtain an authorization, token, and user info endpoint. This process is what allows Zen Key to dynamically choose the right network operator for each of your unique users. You get to leverage the power of one identity platform served by all the major mobile network operators. Second, we'll seek the user's authorization through the Zen Key mobile app. Here, the user will add their consent along with a PIN number or biometric. This, the strong link between the user, their phone, and the mobile network, is what forms Zen Key's uniquely high bar for security. With the user's consent, in the form of this authorization code, we can request access to a user's tokens from the token endpoint we discovered earlier. This will provide us with access to a unique identifier, as well as the user's tokens. We can look at these tokens to verify the integrity of this entire round trip, as well as use this access token to introspect the user's information. With this information, we can power rich experiences within our application. There's a lot here, so, to really understand everything that's going on, let's dive into some examples. 